Hi, I'm Michael Bryant with Valley Microscope Company. We're based out of Winchester, Virginia. However, we do travel within a 200 mile radius from Winchester and provide on-site service uh, for doctors, schools, colleges, um, veterinarians, ABGYN type clinics, as well as dermatology clinics. Uh, basically anyone who utilizes a microscope. Today we're at Dr. Hot's office and I'm going to be servicing this microscope. It's an American Optical Spencer. Uh, so let me just list the steps that I do as far as the cleaning service uh, goes. Uh, clean the ocular eye pieces of the microscopes and uh, what we do is we clean the interior uh, lenses that's inside if necessary. If not, then we'll just clean the exterior. We just may also make sure that they're dust free. Um, then from there, I take this head apart and make sure that the prisms and mirrors are free from any dust or debris. And then the next stage from there is to service the optics, make sure they're clean and free of dust. Uh, on this model we have the 10, 40, and 100 power. And the 100 power is our oil objective. Uh, it's important to keep these clean. And if you ever have to use the oil objective, you want to make sure you either use a cam white or a terracloth and make sure they're clean as soon as you're done using that whenever you're looking uh, at mic microscope slides. And then uh, from there we also clean and disinfect the mechanical stage as well as lubricate any moving parts such as your X and Y axis uh, mechanical control uh, sta stage controls and then from there, we clean and disinfect the condenser. As you can see, this one's uh, pretty dirty here. And then we uh, also make sure that your iris diaphragm moves open freely. And, and occasionally we can repair the leaves of the iris diaphragm if they are out of whack or, or is not functioning properly. <clears throat> So that's one thing we'll make sure we're done, make sure everything's calibrated after we get done cleaning the optics. And last and foremost, we have the illuminator. Let's make sure the light housing is clean and also any blue filters you may have. Your blue filter may either be underneath the condenser and sometimes they're inside the light housing. And then with this one, you have a blue filter inside the light housing. So we'll just assemble this, make sure that it gets cleaned and that you have enough light coming through the unit. So at this point, uh, we'll come back and see if Dr. Hot's satisfied with this service. <clears throat>